Hello, welcome to Math with Niall. Today we're learning about shapes. Shapes, that sounds so interesting. We've got lots of shapes here. What kind of shapes are they called? 3D shapes. 3D shapes and 3D shapes and 2D shapes are different because 2D shapes are flat. Do you know any 2D shapes? Rectangles and squares. Good job. Do you know any more? No. What about a circle? Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Good. So, these ones, they're all called 3D shapes. Let's have a look at that big red one at the end. Do you know what that's called? Sphere. It is called a sphere. Very good. Does that remind you of anything that you play with? I see you throwing it in the air. A ball. A ball. Good. Can we put that one back? Can you lift up the other sphere for us? Very good. What's next to the sphere, the one at the end? Uh. That yellow one. Yeah, pick, pick the yellow one up. Yeah, hold the red one now. And what do you see? If you had to compare those, what does it look like? Half of a circle. Half of a sphere. And there's a name for half of a sphere. Do you know what it's called? No. It's called a hemisphere. A hemisphere. A hemisphere. Very good. Can you put those back for me, please? No. Now, can you pick up that big blue one there? Good job. Can we look at the top of it? What shape is at the top? A circle. A circle. And turn it over and tell me what shape is at the bottom. A circle. A circle. Do you know what that's called? No. It's called a cylinder. 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 Good job. You've got lots of cylinders there. Yeah, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You do have seven cylinders. Well done. Can we pick the one up next to the cylinder? Good. Can you tell me what's the shape on top of it? A uh, triangle. And the shape at the bottom? Triangle. Can you see they're the same size? Yeah. Yes. That is called a triangular prism. A triangular prism? Yeah, that's what it's called. You want to put it back? And let's look at the other one, the yellow one. Ooh, that's a tough one. What's that shape at the top? Uh, I don't know. How many? Can you count the sides? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six sides. Do you know what a six-sided shape is called? A sixtagon. Sixtagon. That's a very good guess. It's called a hexagon. Hexagon. And that shape is a hexagonal prism a hexagonal prism because the hexagon is on top and can you see the hexagon at the bottom as well yep good job let's put that one back pick up the big blue one now come a bit closer that one can you look at you know what those are called? Can you show they're called faces? Uh, they're called faces. Can you point out the face? That's a face. Can you show me another face? Yeah, they're all faces. Can you tell me how many faces that has? Four. No, check five. it again. Don't guess. Have a One, count. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six faces. And can you tell me something about the shape of each face? Uh, they all have squares. They all have squares and there's a special name for that. It's called a cube. Can you say cube? Cube. That's when you've got six faces and they're all the same size. Let's have a look at the big red one. Good. That is very similar to a cube. 
but this one is called a cuboid. Can you see, can you tell me the shapes of the faces? It has rectangle, 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 four rectangles, yes. and two square faces. Very good, Niall, very good. Can you put that one in front of you, please? And can you get the big blue one and put it in front of you? Good. And can you get the yellow one? Good. And can you get the other yellow one? And can you get that blue one? Okay. So, these are all prisms. These are all prisms. They're different types of prisms, but they've all got one shape that starts on one end and goes all the way through. So can you pick the red one up? Good. Can you point at the top shape? What's the shape on top? Square. Can you see that square going all the way through and coming out on the other side? Yeah. Turn it over and have a look. Yep. That's what makes that shape a prism. So let's put that back. Now pick up the one with the circular face. Good. Can you see the circle starting at the top and going all the way through? And coming out on the other side that's what makes that shape a prism can you remember the name of it uh, no. a cylinder a cylinder good can you pick up the one with the triangular face and can you show us can you show us it's got the same triangle on both ends very good and that's what makes that a prism it's a triangular prism let's do one more let's pick up the the other yellow one can you remember the name of the face that has six sides hexagon hexagon so the hexagon can you show us that a hexagon starts on one end and come out on the other mm -hmm. side yeah very good and that's what prisms are they've got a shape that goes all the way through can you say that a prism has the same shape going all the way through a prism has the same shape going all the way through do you know what this shape is called it's a cross section cross section yes but you're going to learn a bit more about that when you get older can we put those back That one's the cuboid. Put Cube. it on this side here. Mm -hmm. Yep, right there. Mm -hmm. Good. Triangular prism mm -hmm. and hexagonal prism. Very good. Okay, let's look at these little ones here. These? Yes. What do they look like? Triangles. Do so they look like triangles? Yeah. They remind me of something that you eat ice cream on. A cone. And do you know that's what they're called? Cones. Exactly. <laughs> they're called cones. You want to pick one up and turn it over and let's have a look at it? <laughs> exactly. They look like little cones. Let's put that back. And let's pick up the big red one at the end. Yep, that's it. That is called, what shape is at the bottom? Triangle. Yes. That is called a triangular. And the circle at the top. A circle? They meet at a point. I think we should call that a point. So it's got a triangle at the bottom and that's a pyramid. You see all those faces coming up and meeting at a point? Yeah. That is a pyramid. But pyramids 
you have to name the pyramid depending on the shape at the bottom of it. What Pyram shape is it at the bottom? Triangle. So that's a triangular pyramid. Let's have a look at this one here, the green one at the end. That is another pyramid because this, the, all the faces come up and meet at a point, but you need to look it at them. It looks like a gem. It does look like a gem. But you need to look at the shape underneath to decide a square. It's called a square based pyramid. Very good. You want to put that back? Let's see how many of these you remember the names of. The face is a hexagon. It's called a hexagonal prism, but very good. Have you forgotten all the others? I'm trying to. You're trying to think. Do we have? A... No, we don't. Okay, I'll give you a clue. What's that red one there called? A sphere, good. And the yellow one next to it. Uh, it starts with an H. Hemisphere. I was about to say hemisphere. <laughs> it's a hemisphere. What about this big blue one there? It's called a cylinder. And the one next to it, these are triangular prisms. I should have guessed that, I knew it. You knew it. And then we've got hexagonal prisms. Hexagonal prisms. And this one is a cube. Cube. And this one is a cuboid. Cuboid. And then a cone. A cone. And then we've got a triangular based pyramid. The triangular based pyramid. And, and the gem. Square based pyramid that looks like a gem. Good job. And that is our lesson for today. So, Niall, what do you think about these shapes? Good. Did you enjoy that lesson? Yeah. Did you learn a lot? Yeah. Good job. See you next time. Bye-bye. Now we have some practice questions for you to try. When you're ready, pause the video and have a go. When you're finished and ready for the answers, press play.